All right, so what we're gonna do right now is we're gonna cover the Hero web part and see how we can make updates, add a link, and also even change the format so that we can add an extra link. As you can see right now, we have four clickable interactive links here. What we wanna do is we wanna go up to the top right on the page where we see the pencil icon and edit, click on that. When we do, uh, we're gonna see a plus icon to the left here. Uh, it says add a new section. That's not what we want to do. That's the section where the hero is actually in. So what we want to do is we want to click inside this section and we want to go up here and we want to edit the web part where the pencil shows up. When we do that, we're going to see the option for the hero web part, which allows us to format the way we want to the end viewer's uh, liking. So we can do a one tile two tiles, three tiles, four tiles, which is what it currently is, or hey, for the sake of discussion, let's add another one, five tiles, okay? So now you see here you have an option for another tile. Well, how do we get this to render the same way these other tiles are showing? Okay, let's do that. So now what we want to do is you want to come in and we want to hit select link. And when you come in here, what this is essentially doing is this is going to be providing the information for the web part itself so that when you go to that home page, it's going to show the interaction. So on this right here, we're going to go from a link. You can provide the link if you want right there. Actually, what we're going to do is we're going to take the link from the site here that we're utilizing so that we can just show the example. We're going to hit add. So the link is in there now. Okay, but there, as you see, there's no image that's interactive like the other ones. So what you want to do to add an image is you want to click on this pencil icon again. You will go to the right here. You can click on the title, which is where you see these right here. So the title for this, and this is important, is very important, will be uh, say David's test site because that's what this URL is actually linking to. The background image, we can either do a color block, which is going to do the same color options that are on the theme for the page, a custom image, or you can do an auto select image, which is what it was already set on. Now, custom image, if you want to go and change this, you scroll down, you select change, and this is where you have these awesome stock images that uh, Microsoft has provided. So we're just going to come here and we're just going to type in computer. And just find a nice little image there click insert and there you go now to publish this and have this render what you want to do is is you want to hit republish at the top but before that let's say well you know what David's test URL this is not the order that I wanted it let's say this should be the main item that when you come to the home page you want to view that's where you want to click on this icon next to the pencil with the arrows and you can drag and you can drop it wherever you'd like it. Once that's placed and you like the setup, you just go ahead, hit republish. It's going to republish the home page. And there you go. There you have it. You have an interactive link there. Um, this is how you update the hero web part and if you click on it, you'll see it'll take us right back to the site because that's what the URL we dropped in there.